Local health authorities are on alert for community-based transmissions as the country reported dozens of new COVID-19 cases today, most of them cluster infections from religious gatherings in the capital. Kim Zhang min updates us on the situation. South Korea reported 35 new COVID-19 cases on Monday, 30 of which were from community-based transmissions. While cases linked to the Bucheon Logistics Center have been slowing down, cases related to religious gatherings are starting to grow within the metropolitan area. The Korean government on Monday urged the public to refrain from face-to-face -face religious gatherings as 24 of the new cases were linked to these events. If face-to-face -face gatherings are inevitable, please limit the size of gathering to ensure sufficient distance between participants. Make sure to wear a mask and wash hands frequently. Please refrain from singing and shouting as that could cause droplet infection, and it is best to avoid large group meals. So far, there has been one death related to the cluster infection from recent religious gatherings, and another patient is in a critical condition. Three additional cases related to the Bucheon Logistics Center were reported on Monday, bringing the total number of related cases to 112. Of these, 74 were the center's employees, while the rest were infected through contact with them. Describing logistics center and telemarketing offices as high-risk groups for infection, the head of the Central Disease Control Headquarters also called for measures to create safer environments for these businesses. She added that distancing in daily life in schools and education facilities is also crucial as they could potentially become the roots of further cluster infections. South Korea's total confirmed cases now stand at 11,503, with the death toll at 271 after one additional death on Monday. Kim Sung-min, Arirang News.